The incense cedar, Calocedrus ducrens, is a member of the cypress family. It is common in the peninsular range of mountains, the Sierras, and the Cascade Range. In the wild, it can reach heights of up to 150 feet with a trunk girth of 8 to 10 feet. The bright green scale leaves are about 2 inches in length and are well suited to snow loads. The leaves interlace in four flattened rows forming a cylinder-shaped cascade of green. It is most often found in mixed conifer stands as a solo tree. It has male and female parts on the same tree. The male cone is yellow and located on the end of leaves. The female cone looks like a duckbill and has four pair of seeds and two slots. When the cone opens on the tree, the seed floats on the air. The shape of the seed cover is designed to fly on the wind. The bark is red to reddish brown and is flaky when young and thick and platy furrowed when old. This tree has commercial value. Its wood is aromatic, soft, and lightly grained. It is used in furniture and closets and chests for moth protection and making of pencils. The wood shapes very easily and does not splinter. It's also used as a carving wood. The incense cedar is hardy and has few problems with insects. Older trees that have been damaged or burned will develop a fungal infection, Polyporus amorous, called heart rot. The fungus eats away the heartwood which weakens the tree. This does cause commercial loss in some areas where it is logged. There can be a cull rate as high as 36% of the harvest. Local tribes use incense cedar bark as a building material and its young bark as tinder in fire starting. Incense cedar, Calocedrus ducrens, an important member of the mountain habitat.